Hey, yo, boys, check this out. Hey, nerd, watch your step. Have you guys noticed that kids aren't afraid of us anymore? Bro, it's because they're all obsessed with that game. Check it out. I'm back later. I'm playing Honkai Star Rail. What's Honkai Star Rail? It's a space fantasy role-playing game. It literally won best game of the year on Google Play and the App Store last year. You guys must be living under a rack. Who wants a swirly? <laughs> so you finish the space adventure first. Huh? Ever since Hawk and Star Rail released New World Pentacony, I just can't put it down. Pentacony? It's a dream world full of rich scenery and tons of hidden layers to uncover. Oh, those graphics are insane! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like someone's getting a wedgie sandwich for lunch! <laughs> Did you just unlock a new character on Honkai Star Rail? Actually, I just pulled two new characters. Zachron, a mysterious interstellar wanderer with crazy burst damage. What about that one? Oh, that's Venture. He's handy because he can stack multiple shields. He also just looks super cool. <laughs> Hey, you guys forgot to take our lunch money. Not now. I'm trying to pull Akron. I gotta see this burst damage. Told you. Get him hooked in there or leave us alone. <laughs> Ow. Wait a minute. Did we just get played? Eh. If you can't beat him, join him. Hey, Darman fam. Download Honkai Star Rail using the link in the description to unlock new characters and use my redemption code below to redeem 50 Stellar Jade. Now let's go ahead and start today's video. to get up. Breakfast needs to be made and the kitchen is a disaster. I told you about neglecting your chores. Huh? I, I cleaned the kitchen last night like I always do. Don't you get sassy with me, Missy. Now you go clean up. We don't have all day. What happened? I left this kitchen spotless. Surprise! We left this mess just for you. Our favorite little maid. Yeah, I mean, you didn't actually expect us to clean this up, right? Whatever. Just leave your mugs on the counter. Um, what about breakfast, stepsister? Yeah. Do you want us to starve? I mean, you could stand to lose a couple pounds, Tanya. Are you serious? My waist is way more snatched than yours. Oh, really? Go get the measuring tape then. Let's do it. And while we're at it, let's ask mom. Oh, yeah, mom's gonna agree with me. Um, are you serious? I'm her favorite, so... It doesn't matter. You believe I've never been to a school dance? Not one. Oh, I mean, it's an abomination. I mean, do you think Eva, the Eva stepmother, will let you go to this one? Have you met that fire-breathing dragon? There's no way she's letting me go. I mean, you never know. I mean, you should prepare just in case. I mean, my girl Camilla, she makes these really dope masquerade masks, and I bet she'd make you one on the low, since you're my BFF. <laughs> <laughs> on the low would be great. You know I'm broke. Uh, can you text me her number? Yeah. Okay, I know what you're gonna say. What do you have against phone chargers? Your phone is always dead. I know, I know. I need to get it together. <laughs> But I have it memorized. It's two, three, five, one, two, zero, nine. One, two, zero, nine? You sure that's it? I don't want to end up texting some serial killer. Positive. I mean, she's had the same number since she was like 11. Hey. <gasps> oh my gosh. Uh You're good. Oh my gosh, Devin, we are so sorry. Yeah, our stepsister, she's a social imbecile. <laughs> it's fine, guys, no problem. So, are you taking anyone to the masquerade ball, Devin? Um, I'm not really sure, still deciding. <laughs> smells so good, like sweat and oak trees. Thanks. Seriously, Trin, it's clearly amber woods, not oak. Oh, so you're like an expert on cologne now? Yeah, at least I'm an expert at something. At least I don't look like a rainbow fruit roll-up. Ah, you joking? Wait. I miss when your dad owned Darla's. 
I swear, ever since your stepmom took over, dollars just keep disappearing from my paycheck. Well, at least you get a check. What? You don't get paid? Is that even legal? According to Eva's laws, it is. Plus a whole lot of other horrible stuff she does to me. I just still don't understand why your dad didn't leave a will. All this should have been yours. I know, right? But instead, I'm modern-day Cinderella. Here, take this. Patricia, what are you doing? I can't take this. Eva keeps all the tips. If my stepmom found out... No, 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 please. If you're not getting paid, you should at least keep the tips. Here, take it before she puts it in the safe. You know she's the only one with the code. Is this what I pay you for? To stand around and talk? I mean, you don't really pay us much anyway. What do you want me to do? Times are tough. Well, I could fire you. How about that? Now, don't let me catch both of you wasting my time again. Because it's like what I always say. What happens in the dark always comes to light. Lord, I am trying to remember that I am one of your children, but I swear that woman makes me want to commit crimes. Well, please don't commit any until after I ask her about the masquerade ball. Masquerade ball? Ooh, I haven't been one of those since 19... Doesn't matter. You have to go. We'll see. Hopefully she's in a good mood tonight. What? What is this? Where are the sesame seeds? You, you, you're incompetent! <laughs> Hopefully. I told you I was wearing this dress to the ball, Trinity. Well, too bad I got it first, Tanya. Oh! Ah! I finished with the dusting. It took you long enough. Now go and clean the girls' rooms next. Seriously? Shouldn't they be... Okay, I'll clean it. Hmm. I still hear you breathing. Um, sorry. I, um, wanted to ask you something. <sighs> At school, there's a masquerade ball coming up, and I've never been to a dance before. I was wondering if I could possibly maybe be able to go? I suppose it could be possible. If you do your chores that day. Really? Mm-hmm. What? what? Uh-huh. We'll see. Now, chop, chop. The girls' bedrooms are a mess. Okay. Thanks, Eva. Um, are you okay, Mommy? Yeah. Did you hit your head or something? Lizzie cannot go to the ball. She'll ruin our rep. My princesses, don't worry. You know, Mommy always has a plan. <laughs> You trust me, okay? <laughs> These are good. Gio, I'm gonna kill you.
it'll be 65.21. Thank God Patricia gave me that tip money. Wouldn't have enough otherwise. You know, your dad should have dated Patricia, not Eva. <laughs> Tell me about it. Ooh, you look sharp, Gio. Or should I call you Giancarlo? Thank you. I mean, I had to pull out all the stops. I might be third wheeling since Lizzie is in love. Oh, wait, girl, why aren't you dressed? My dress is in the back. I'm still waiting on Randy to get here to take over my shift. He's running late. I told you I can cover. No, but I need you to help me get ready. <sighs> wait, I can take over. Okay, I used to wait tables at my uncle's restaurant in the Bronx. If I can survive that, this is nothing. Okay. Well, what are you waiting for? Go on. I got you. I got you. I hope he shows up. I am so nervous. Oh my god, don't be. He's clearly obsessed with you. Come on, <laughs> let's go. And where did you manage to get that dress? You don't have any money. She borrowed it. It's my sister's. Who also made our masks. Yeah, and it's very obvious. <laughs> Definitely hand-me-downs. How embarrassing. Well, did you do all? Of your chores, Lizzie? Yes. I cleaned the kitchen, bathroom, vacuumed the living room, took out the trash, organized the garage, and all the other things in your list, too. Hmm. <gasps> oh, I'll take care of that for you, Chef. <clears throat> all righty. Since you did all of your chores, I guess you are going to the... No! My dress! I'm so sorry, Lizzie. I guess you're not going to the ball after all. Now, clean up this mess. What? Let's go, ladies! Oh my god. Those evil step snakes of yours did that on purpose! This is so unfair! She has to go to the dance. I'm just gonna text She's Boy and tell him I'm not going. Oh, there's no way I can go looking like this. Wait! I have a dress! In my trunk! Don't ask me why! I'll be right back. I decided that I don't like her. Ted Bundy? Macaroni girl? <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna lie, I thought I was gonna get catfished by some weird old guy. Don't worry, at midnight I turned back into him. <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna lie, I'm pretty nervous. There's no way I could dance in front of everyone. I've got an idea. Follow me. That's why he's not giving us any attention? We need to figure out who that mystery girl is. 
Eddie. <laughs> so, I think it's time we do the big reveal. Is it weird that I'm nervous? No, I'm definitely nervous too, but it's all good. I'll go first. That has led us here today. She was not a Devin Cosner. No way, you're like the most popular guy in school. <laughs> I don't know about all that. <laughs> okay, your turn. We had both loved and lost, and we both. Oh my gosh, I have to go. Wait, where are you going? I'm so, so sorry, I'll, I'll text you or FaceTime you. Well, can't you at least take off your mask? I don't even know your name. Here, I'll take it. I can't believe she's boy is Devin Cosner. <gasps> Who's that? <laughs> Oof. He's a looker. <laughs> He's asking me for a photo. You mean you didn't show him? Well, what are you waiting for? Send him one. <laughs> Still shook he was dancing with that girl in the blue dress. He should have been talking to me. Hi, Lizzie. How's the ball? Oh, that's right. You couldn't come. Enjoyed your spaghetti dinner? <laughs> We're not gonna be here long, girls. Just gonna get all the cash. Patricia, Lizzie, come help me. Trinity, come look at this. Is that Devin Cosner on Lizzie's phone? What the heck? Said, send me a pic without your mask macaroni girl. What is he talking about? Ooh. Oh, let's go tell mom. Wait, I have a better idea. You know, I can't believe you didn't text him back last night. I just couldn't. It's literally Devin Cosner. Yes, so? You're Lizzie Rossi. I mean, if those texts were genuine, he's not gonna care about anything else. You should go talk to him. I mean, what do you have to lose? Oh, look at this. Look at this. Everyone, what you're looking at are texts between Devin Cosner and the school's biggest dork. Our stepsister, Lizzie. Are you happy to find out the identity of your macaroni girl, cheese boy? A loser. <laughs> your macaroni girl? <laughs> <laughs> Bye-bye, macaroni girl. <laughs> so, you've been texting a boy behind my back this whole time. No, he, he's just a friend. Oh, yeah, right. You know your sisters like him, so you had to just swoop on in and ruin it all. Well, you may have everyone else fooled, but I got your number, Missy. What are you doing? You'll get it back next year. And when you're not at work or school, you'll be locked away in your room. <laughs> you can't do that. Oh, I can and I will. And you'll be working double shifts here at the diner because I own this place. Not anymore. What are you talking about? This right here is James Rossi's will. You know, I always wondered why you never gave anyone the code to the safe, but now I know why. Luckily, I was able to guess it. Lizzie's birthday. My dad had a will? But you told me he didn't. That's because he left you everything. The house, the diner, it's all yours, Lizzie. Which you knew about, and that's why you kept it from her. I, I, give me that. 
should have done that a long time ago. Now, no one will know, and the house and the diner stays with us. <laughs> what is it that you're always telling us? What happens in the dark always comes to light? Thanks for confirming that you did know about the will and you kept it from Lizzie. That's all the cops needed to know. Oh, cops. <laughs> That's... What? Huh? Who? You want to arrest a fraud. With the right Fra to remain silent, anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you can't afford one, one will be provided to you. Call the blind lawyer! <laughs> you won't be the one needing to mop anymore. But I know who will. Mm. This ice cream is amazing. Did you guys try it? Here, just have a bite. Actually, never mind. We can talk after you're done with the dishes, laundry, mowing the lawn, taking out the trash, and all your other chores. Then maybe you can have one small bite. What's that? Do you want to go find somewhere else to live? Because I'm totally okay with you doing this. Please, don't we'll do whatever you say. Just don't make us leave. We have nowhere else to go. That's what I thought. Chop, chop. Devin, how do you know where I live? I found your address online. I know I said I was Ted Bundy, but I swear I'm not a serial killer. <laughs> I hope not. What are you doing here? Lizzie, you're the best friend I've ever had. And to be honest, I can't stop thinking about you. Not because of the way that you look or the social status that you have, but because you're you. And that's not to say that you're not beautiful, because honestly, you are. Mask or no mask, I think you're perfect. Are you serious? You want her? Yeah, I do. More than anyone I've ever wanted before. I'm sorry for not defending you at school. But I promise if you give me one more chance, I will always have your back moving forward. So what do you say, macaroni girl? Will you be my girlfriend? I would love to. Cheese boy. <laughs> Good news? Just come here and kiss me. Oh, What are you smiling at? It's just funny. My plan worked. She actually thought I gave her the wrong number. 